for today. My name's Eric, and this is my wife, Monica. Hi. And we're from the channel Smoking Barbecue Tips and Recipes. And on this episode, <laughs> we're going to do something a little different. No recipe today. Uh, if you're familiar with my channel, you saw three or four videos back. We had a nice video where we were discussing that we were moving from Southern California to Wisconsin. And here we are in our brand new kitchen. And so this video is just going to show you the transition, some moving footage from back in California. I'm going to show you my old place of employment, Indian Motorcycle of Orange County. I'm going to show you uh, us packing, us flying here, checking out the area, unpacking, finding uh, or checking out the house here for the first time. The whole enchilada. The whole enchilada. <laughs> and this is just oh, for... Enchiladas. Enchilada. <laughs> I miss those. There's a couple Mexican places in town we haven't tried yet, but we're anticipating it's not going to be as good as what we're used to in Southern California. But hey. You're going to have you to know. up your game with the Mexican. <laughs> and to celebrate, I have this awesome a bottle of blackened whiskey that I got from a very good friend, Tom Rogers, whose wife, uh, Carol, a.k.a. Kitty. Uh, who I, office wife. My <laughs> office wife, who I've uh, worked on and off with, uh, I think, 20 years, if not more, over three different dealerships. Um, that was one of the bad, sad parts about moving because I had a very great uh, job uh, back in Southern California. But it was time to move on. But he gave me this as a going away present and I told him I'll save it and we're gonna have a shot uh, to celebrate our finally arriving in our new home. And we're gonna have a little chaser uh, we are in Chippewa Falls, Wisconsin. One of the most famous things we're known for is the Leinenkugel Brewery, which has been here since, uh, how long is it? 1867. So, over 150 years. Even our dog has the Liney. <laughs> and this is just their original beer. They got tons of different uh, uh, flavors, I guess, or, or different types of beers. They're most uh, famous for their lemon, is it Shandy? Shanty? Is it? Summer. Summer shand Summer shandy. 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 And it basically, it's like uh, beer mixed with a little bit of lemonade. It's not my really, uh, my cup of tea. I reviewed it several videos ago, maybe a year ago, because uh, that one's pretty popular. It's available in all uh, 50 states. Uh, but I like their regular stuff. And this I like is the dark, too. Yeah, they have one called the Creamy Dark, which I really like. This is just their original one, which is compatible to like Miller, Bud, and it's pretty good. So anyway, let's and they get have a vanilla porter that's really good. They have a vanilla yeah. porter. They have they have quite a different, uh, quite a few different versions. All right, let's get this thing open. And if you guys don't know, I guess this blackened, what Tom was telling me, is owned by the members of the rock band Metallica. Oh, there we go. And uh, I guess when they infuse it, or when they, I don't know, when that whatever they do when they prepare it, they actually send it through sound waves. Of different Metallica songs, cool. and so this one was Bash on 110. I went online, and I guess each member picks five or six different songs that they like, and then as they're making this batch of several, I don't know how many bottles, they kind of infuse the music while they're making it. I don't know; it might be a little gimmicky thing, but kind of. <laughs> well, who knows? Well, it's kind of a cool concept. Yeah, I don't know. So I've never tried it before. But, you know, I like whiskey, so it's a, a celebrate, so, yeah. celebratory <laughs> celebratory toast uh, to our new home and our new adventure. A special thank you to Tom and Carol. Yes, thank you very much. Okay, so I got a little beer here. As always, guys, I appreciate you watching the video. Yeah. I was going to. You want to smell it? Yeah, probably shouldn't. Ooh, this, is, this, is, <laughs> this is stronger than normal. This is uh, 90 proof. Jeez. 45% alcohol. Woo. All right, guys, again, thanks for watching the video. I appreciate all my viewers. Thank you so much. Cheers. Cheers. Cheers right. to our new start. Cheers to our new start. Mmm. Ooh, it's got a little bit of a bite to it. We'll definitely, need, definitely need a beer chaser. But very good. Thanks again, Tom. I will definitely enjoy the bottle. So anyway, I'm going to cut to some footage of the whole moving process. You guys can check it out. And uh, we'll come back at the very end and kind of give you our final thoughts, uh, what we really think once we got here, if we have any second thoughts or doubts, and all that other good stuff. So stay tuned, check out the video. We'll be back in a little bit. We hope you like it.
Alright guys, moving day. The truck should be here in a little over an hour. It's around 6.40 in the morning. And it is pouring rain. In good old sunny California where it rains like five or six days a year. As luck would have it, we're going to have it pouring rain on the day we're moving. All our possessions. And I mean, it's rated pretty hard. You can see some water's already puddling here. Of course, it doesn't take much to puddle here in California. <sighs> but you know what? So be it. It's not going to stop us. We're out of California. But I mean, what, what are the odds? All right. Thank goodness the rain stopped. The truck has arrived. We got three guys working like crazy. I just wanted to kind of come out here and let you guys see what's going on. I think this is the same size truck that me and Mr. John Yee rented when we moved our family out here to California back in the late 80s. Back then we loaded it and drove it ourselves, but this time they're loading it and driving it and I'm flying. So. Take a look, see. Hey, Kyle, you help it too, huh? Yeah. All right, we're well on our way. All right, just about done here. Just putting the bikes in. Got my uh, Blackstone griddle, my pit barrel, my kettle grill, and my smoke hollow all on there and board as well. It did start it raining. Uh, you see the reflection there around 25 minutes ago. And uh, <laughs> one last thing. But luckily the sun's out now. So now it's, now it's looking pretty good. Someone's mowing wet grass. Ah, well here we are. Oh, yeah. Okay, here we go. One, right. two, three. B. There. Yeah, All right, now give him. That okay. poor phone, I've dropped it so many times. Come on. All right, we're getting ready to leave Long Beach, heading to Denver. Hey, Kyle. All right. Oh, a little bit of a fiasco getting Dixie <laughs> sitting in the can. Yeah. Yeah. Ava Grace. Say hi. Ava. Push it in. I'll Say help hi. you. Say hi. Hi. And hi. then we got Dixie okay. underneath. Okay. Her dog in a bag underneath. <laughs> it's a little difficult getting through. And the plane's empty. Right now. Right now. <laughs> but they said there was only 70 people. But it sits 160, she said? Yeah. So it's like it can be half the flight. So it's going to be a quick and easy flight. <sighs> All right, guys. We'll see you in Denver. Can I do Say hi, Ava Grace. Hi. Say hi, Kyle. We're at Minneapolis hi. in Minnesota. Hi, where, where are we? 
Minneapolis and Minnesota, and now we're up north. Let's get going. We're in yeah. Minnesota and Minneapolis. And, uh, well, yeah, between Monica is in line to get our rental car. All right, this is our new place. None of us have seen it. Hi. I got um. Who's Dixie, gonna open up? I I got Dixie's puppies that she got on December 10. This is dog and this is doggy. Okay. And they're gonna be having yes, a yes. tour too with you guys. Yes. All right, let's go in and see. Come on, we're gonna join. Yeah, come on over. Go ahead, you can open. Let's go and check it out, guys. Here we are, a new place. Oh, it smells good in here. Oh, I love the smell of houses. <laughs> New house. All right, so let's see. That's the garage. Let's check out the garage first. Oop. There's a step, Ava Gray, so be careful. I know, that's the same thing as the old garage. Okay. We got some shelving. I can see people like a sofa here in the TV. No, we're in the parking here. We can put our racks now, though, on the side. Okay, so let's go in here. Here in this garage. All right, well, let's close this door. All right. Okay. Oh, well, right, Is there a switch over here? Let's see. Oh, oh she's already doing the there's... steps. Oh, she right. knows how to climb stairs. In oh. What's in there? Oh. And this is just a oh. little hallway closet. Okay. Okay, so here's the, here's the bathroom. Oh, this is and this is the laundry room, Monica. Here's this is where we're going to be filming. Let's see. Let me see. Yeah, this is going to be my new location, at least for the year. This is nice. This is so cool. What do we got here? Shower hooks. Oh, she left a, a shower curtain for us. She what? Shower curtain. Okay. Some coffee and slippers. Okay, let's do a welcome gift in there for us. Wow, she left some cheese curds, Kyle. She just left us a welcome gift. Are you kidding me? Some cheese sticks and some beef sticks oh and some goodness. cheese curds. She knows curds. we like beef and cheese. <laughs> oh, what a nice landlady. All right. Did you turn it on? Yeah, I just turned it It was on. I just turned it on a little more. Then I should turn up the stairs because everyone's been up here. No one's been down there. Oh, this turns the light Okay, on. let's go upstairs. It might be best to take our shoes off in the future, like just to keep it. Wow, we haven't been plowing wow. through snow. Okay, hang on. So this is this is I guess would be the dining room when you first come in, huh? And there's the kitchen. And we got electric fire or a gas fireplace. So I think you just turn the switch and it comes on. Dixie Dew can run out here too. Well, there's a downstairs. I guess you could. Well, I'm not sure how that works. We'll figure that out. And here's where we can. Uh, oh, it looks like one of the internet right here. For the cable, Monica. Okay. Yep. Okay. Let's go out here and let's see. We got There's a little. Stairs. I love this oh. house. It's way better than that. Stairs. Hey, look at the solar lights here. So much. Solar light. This is so cool. Stay here, Dixie. No. It's kind of cold out here, but I like. Stay. Stay. Dixie, no. Look, Poppy. So here. here's the back. Down to the Dixie, I don't like I don't like it open like so well, from, from the balcony we can go There's down balcony. here and go run out. So the houses are kind of close down. together but they kind of it's kind of weird. No fences or nothing. Look, they have some Interesting. Has a playground set out here. Little stairs Someone to get down. All right. Whoa, I can see that. She's All like, right. what is this? So now what's this room here? This is I think the master. This room? Okay. But here's the thermostat here. I think this okay. will be the master bedroom. It's just like a closet. It might not be. Oh, this is because there's a bathroom right here. There's okay, well, it looks like there's well, a just, there's see. a connection. Maybe this should be Kyle's room. No, it'll be Kyle's Yeah. Well, I don't we'll know. See. We got to we'll see all the rooms. We'll see the other rooms. I like bathrooms in my room. We'll, we'll see. Okay. Closet. So let's see in here. There's a bathroom with a sh with a tub. Wow. Nice. This is gonna be the master bedroom. Oh, there's two two closets. So that, I think one's for the bathroom and stuff, maybe. Maybe, I don't know. Okay. I want this room. Well, let's, let's see. see. We gotta see. That's the master bedroom. That's for mom and dad. You gotta light on a fan. Okay. Hold on to the rail, Ava Grace. Yeah, just take it easy. You're doing good. I'm practicing going up and downstairs. See, you like the somewhere? Yeah. Okay, no, now let's check out the downstairs. Okay, let me go down this time. Okay, you go first. Go on. Let's check out the Dixie, you like your new place? 
<laughs> yes, she does. This is okay, now. Okay. So let's start over. Oh my goodness. Oh, there's a bathroom. Start going that way first. Oh, bathroom. Wait a minute. Okay, open, turn on. Lights. Little dark. Hit the light, Tom. Where's the light? Right okay. when you walk in. So there's another full bath here. Okay. Okay. And then okay. we have. Will this be whose room? Will this be our bedroom? It looks like these are all wired already. Okay, this is a big. For room. internet. This is a nice closet. And then there's another room that looks like the same thing. Mm -hmm. Okay. Oh, it goes down more. There's one well, that's probably the basement. Same thing here. Oh, you, this would be perfect Same for thing. you guys. It's huge. Well, if you try to figure out where we're going to put... And this is well, this this might be Ava Grace's room, then? Yeah, yeah this, this might be my room. Well, we'll figure that out off the floor. Now, down here is the basement. Let's go see the basement. Oh, okay. Let's go check out the basement. And then here. Hey, you know what, Monica? Huh. This should be the office area. What? I said that, Eric. I said this should be the family room. This is room. where I should set up my desk for editing and stuff. Yeah, this should be the family room, like you had before. Put the black sofa yeah. down here? Yes. Okay. And the TV, and this is like the room that you had in the back room. Do we have a light? This would be perfect for that. Yeah, look, there's always a light by the front, uh, by the door. This is unfinished. Is there any light in here? This is nice. Well, let's see. This should be. There you go. Yeah, it's unfinished, but that's where we can keep there storage. There's cobwebs up here. Ew, what's that? There's like, all the cobwebs. Crazy vehicles in here. Well, this is where the water heater is. This is in like a room. This and this is, is the heater. Room. This is a room where you just put storage. Like you can put boxes in we, here. We feel safe in here because there's like a tornado. Yeah, this is the basement. Yeah. yeah. But you can put, we can put like boxes and stuff in here. Like Overflow yeah. storage. This is like an extra room. Yeah. But look, yeah, there's yeah. these spider webs in the corner. This is all a right, well, that's cool. Okay, so this is going to be... The family room. All right, guys. Wow, looks great. It's better than I thought. It's perfect for us. Look at Dixie. She's smiling. Are you smile? <laughs> she is. Dixie, are you happy? Look, she's she smiling. Likes it. Do I you like it so here? much. I got out of this house. I just got it. <laughs> We're going to live here. We're going to live here, Ava. This is our house for the next year. <laughs> so this will be the family room, then. This is what I was Woo, thinking. This is our house. Okay, so. So you will put the black sofa down here and the, the black TV stand and everything that was in our family room. Your dad's gonna get a new connection. Yeah, no, you probably will because it's not. No, it's well, not the. So, no, it's not a full down basement. I look. love this. Normally, thing. a full basement has oh, a full flight of stairs. This only has like one, two, three, four, five, six steps. If it was a full basement, you'd have another six steps and it'd be way down. I think you'll be fine here. But anyways, and it's already wired for Wi-Fi. All right, boy. Our landlord left us some yellow cheese curds in the fridge and some beef sticks. Kyle's never tried cheese curds. Now, these aren't deep fried. These are just a... Give it a try. I now. thought that these would be like a... Well, normally you deep fry them. I thought it would feel like a breaded. No, that's when you get them deep fried. They bread them and then they fry them. Like mozzarella cheese sticks. These are just untreated cheese curds. Look at the camera. What do you think? Oh my gosh. <laughs> Good? <laughs> okay, mom, you try. I'm, I'm gonna eat this whole bag. They smell good. I've never tried the untreated mm. one. Wow. All right, let me try. Wow. At first, they taste like, um, at first, they taste like normal cheese, like just your everyday right. kind of like cheap cheese. And then the more you eat it, they're the like more. sharp. Well, thank you for taking the cat. This is awesome. Whoa. This is so cool. Yeah, you can tell they're not fully aged. So good. But all the cheese flavor is there. Mm. Oh my gosh. Thank you, Christina. From up here. Look what else she left. Mm -hmm. so okay, wait, one more thing. Hang on. Mm. What about the dew? What about her? Do you like she her wants to one? try a little cheese curd. Well, I don't like. Dixie. Here, let me pick her up. Where Come here. You want to try cheese? Oh, they make you thirsty. You want to try cheese curd? They're good. What do you think? Is that I should just inhale that. Is that good? <laughs> you like cheese? Oh, I, cheese. <laughs> right. I think Dixie gave it her approval. Yeah, I think so too. But, but look at how nice she left us a little coffee. <laughs> I think this is a necessity. We're going to have to pick up another <laughs> one, but at least we're covered 
For now, the shower curtain wow. and some shower for one of the bathrooms. Maybe her dog what's what's in the paper there underneath? Oh, some popcorn. Smoking jacket. Some garlic. Oh, look, salsa. It's nice to know they have salsa in Wisconsin. <laughs> Oh, What's this that? is really good smelling soap from Line and Google. Oh, Line and Google soap. Let me smell. Mm -hmm. Does it smell like oh, beer? Oh my gosh. It says it's beer soap. It smells so good. Oh, that does smell good. Oh, thank you so much. This is amazing. And thank you so much for choosing the channel. Look, you have a great awesome. Oh, DCC's Line and Google. She's like, what do you have? So what else do we get here? She left us some Wisconsin string mm -hmm. cheese. And then cool. she left us some. Alright. You guys want to try one of these? Wait, wait, I gotta share something with you. This is barbecue. Yeah. Yeah, barbecue flavored snack sticks. On the back of this? From Rumps. On the back of this it says beer soap made in package by cream of the crop. It's got beer, olive, and coconut oil, lard, high, and fragrance oil. So it's like real and then it says it's the after bar bar. Wow. <laughs> That smells so good. We got a nice dishwasher down here. Soap. So. All right, let's try. Let's try this here next, okay? All right, we took one and split it in thirds. I think Christina got us barbecue flavor because of my channel. <laughs> I think so. <laughs> EricSmokingBarbecue.com. But give it a try, Kyle. Your first uh, Wisconsin beef stick barbecue flavor. I'm sure they have other flavors. Okay. Oh my God. I have a lot to say before you say. <laughs> so. I'm gonna eat. Normally, um, like if you get beef jerky or beef stick, you know, I'm never a big fan of those because they're all like processed. They don't taste that good. I mean, they're still good, like uh, Slim Jims on that. This is so good. Mm. Does it taste like barbecue? Mm. Yeah. What about it, Monica? It has an aftertaste. It's this is the best. All right, let me try. It's so fresh. Spin it around. Let me try. Okay. All right, I've been looking forward to this. I haven't eaten anything You're today. You're gonna have fun cooking curry. out here. Mmm. Really? We're gonna go check out that rumps. Yeah, you got us convinced. We've been waiting for this. That's a little uh, <laughs> mom and pop butcher shop in Eau Claire where she got the cheese curds. Oh, this is good. Wisconsin has so far welcomed us with open arms. Mmm. -mm. Wow. I could live off this. <laughs> cheese curds and beef sticks. Or smoked sauces. Mm-hmm. All right, we're definitely gonna have to try out that uh, rumps. She told us last night. Yeah. To check them out. Wow, she's so sweet. She left us all night. This oh, and then there was a coffee great. there. I was just checking it out. There's a place in Eau Claire, the next town over. No, the coffee in the bag. Mm-hmm. And it's from the. It's goat blend, and it's from the goat. What is it called? The goat coffee house. The goat coffee house in Eau Claire. And so, oh, smell that though. I can't wait to try that. It must be their house blend. Ooh, you know me. I love coffee. That smells great. All right, and we also got some Bucky Badger. The Badger is the official thing of Wisconsin, the University of Wisconsin, our mascot. So we got some uh, popcorn, white cheddar popcorn. So good. And I'm so glad to Hi. see that Wisconsin makes salsa. Yeah. Oh, look at that chip magnet. <laughs> Let me see. Raise your snack standards. Medium oh, salsa. Oh yeah, Ch garlic, garlic chipotle, chipotle wine. That looks. That, sausage that looks really good. Wow. How oh, nice. How do you guys like this place? So awesome. Really? We love it so much, Mom. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> well, hang on. Wait a minute. Why yeah. don't you thank Miss Christina? Yeah, come and here. And Mr. Rob. Her soon-to-be husband say yeah. thank you, Miss Christina. Look at the camera. Rob. Thanks, Miss Christina and Mr. Rob. This is an awesome house. Yeah, whatever she said. <laughs> All right, we're gonna. I gotta be, be waiting out here for the cable guy to arrive later today. Yeah. But uh, yeah, I think we found a nice home, and we're gonna be very happy. Awesome. Thank you. All right, so here's the garage. We're gonna open up. You know, push the button, Kyle. Oh, yeah. Yep, push it. We're gonna walk around and show you guys. Let's walk over here to the street level, take a look. 
very quiet. The houses are kind of far and apart. I mean, certainly compared to California standards. This is a relatively new subdivision. The only downside I see is there's not a whole lot of trees. You can see the trees all planted are relatively new. Uh, I, I said this to uh, Dad off camera, but the weather right now looks like fall. Yeah. So it's it's a unit that it's under one roof, but there's two two units. There's one right there that's currently being occupied, and we're going to be on the one here. And then you can see the amount of space here, the lawn here. I'm glad it includes lawn service, because this lawn just goes on forever. I think the property line is right here. Looks like a friendly neighborhood for kids as well. I think the property line is like right here. Yeah, I actually like it. It's a little brisk, but the sun is shining. It's actually very nice out today. But in the nighttime, it drops down below freezing. It gets to be like the high 20s, mid to high 20s. So yeah, I think I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna leave all my smokers and grills in the garage and just pull them out on the side here in the concrete and do them. I don't want to mess with doing them out here in the wooden deck. So you can see how far back the property goes. This is like a, looks like I think it's for a, a septic tank. I'm not sure. <laughs> I think this is a septic tank. Do not enter tank without proper equipment. I don't know what these things are. What are these things? I have no idea. Looks like they were doing something recently. But anyway, and then you can see it's very wide open. I think within the, like, his name is the square. I think within the square is the square. Yeah. And you can see our neighbor has a fire pit. So I, I think we need to get a fire pit. We'll keep the fire underneath the thing here. And we can bring some lawn chairs out here and sit at night. That'll be nice. And it looks like a whole vacant area over here behind this tree line. And I'm sure once spring comes, when the leaves grow back. But I just wanted you guys to get a scope of the size of the property here. And this is just a rental, at least for a year. And then we're going to get into something that we own, but not bad. Not bad at all. Where are you going, Kyle? All right. And this is in Chippewa Falls, it's actually called the uh, Lake Halley which is kind of right between Chippewa Falls and Eau Claire. Well, I like it. Very nice. There's a crow welcome, uh, welcoming us to the neighborhood, Kyle. Up in the tree there. <laughs> So you excited, Kyle, about our next chapter here? Yeah. He's off. My nose is running a little bit. So <laughs> yeah, yeah, your nose is running a little bit. Hi, Eva Grace. I'm not used to this. Yeah, we're you're not. videoing me? Yeah, do you like this area? You like uh, your your new house? for? I got my Discovery of Learning School of Frisbee. When I was six, I used to be in a public school called DOL Why bring that? Discovery of Learning. Well, she wants to play Frisbee. Well, Mom bring it. Look here, say hi. Hi. <laughs> All right. Yeah, I We have know. a little patio up here. It's right off the main living room. I, I joked around with um um mom and she, I guess she said that one of the um 
one of the um, people at the um, hotel, mm -hmm. they said, uh, they came up like, oh, today is such a nice summer day. It is nice. And I'm like, and it's like 40 degrees. So yeah, I think this is where I'm gonna do my, I'll keep all my grills and smokers in the garage and I'll just wheel them out here against this wall. Well, not right against the wall, obviously, more towards the outskirts of the wall on these nice pieces of cement. I love this house. And that's our front door there. You like it, Ava Grace? Do you want them to hear the doorbell? No, no, it's okay. Dixie will start barking. All right, guys, we're gonna go get something to eat. We'll but we like the place. We'll be back soon. All right, guys, we're here. It's move-in day. It is absolutely beautiful. Yesterday, it was like 40 degrees in the day. Dropped down into the mid to low 20s at night. Today, I'm just wearing a t-shirt. I think it's like 62, 63 degrees. It's crazy, crazy warm. Nice little breeze. I can't believe it. I guess that's Midwest weather for you. One day it's uh, cold as uh, it can be, and the next day it's absolutely gorgeous. I mean, it's just beautiful today. This is like perfect weather for me. I don't like the hot. And I just want to show you the neighbors across the street. We just met them. They have a girl that's Ava Grace's age. I guess it's her birthday today. So uh, they have a bunch of people over. They're just celebrating over here. I really like this neighborhood. And uh, yeah, we're on the do a little I clip showing you what's going on. We got unloading the truck. This is your barbecue stuff. <laughs> my Blackstone, There's my smoker, piano. got a piano, got some bikes. So I'm not going to film too much. I'm just going to uh, help these guys move stuff in. We were concerned that the washer and dryer would not fit in here, but uh, lo and behold, they took the door off the hinges <laughs> and it fits. Yay, yay, yay. Okay. So here we go. There you go, Mom. The slate table made it safely to Wisconsin. Yeah, I put picture frames in there, and my grandpa's All right, here we are. It's all unloaded. They just left. I am exhausted. It's gonna be probably a, at least a week before we get through all these boxes and stuff, but the. The good news is we're here. We have all our stuff. We have our freezer. We have our piano. My kettle grill. My blackstone. My pit barrels under the cover there. Let's uh, let's go inside, and you can see the chaos that's going on. We close the garage. The guy, you know, they just all move everything inside. So I just wanted to. Oh, hi, Dixie. <laughs> She's had a rough time too. So, in the bathroom, we were very concerned about getting the washer and dryer in here because the space between the toilet and the wall and this door, they actually had to take the door off the hinges. But the guys that came were very knowledgeable. I ran down to the Ace Hardware to get a new uh, dryer duck because it was cracked. And I got two new steel braided lines for the water because I don't want anything to leak, especially since I don't own this place. But there they are, they got them in. They're plugged in, they're ready to go. So we're set there. So here's the one bathroom. <laughs> and like I said, everything's just thrown in here and kind of, we try to label all the boxes, but of course, you know, as you go along, it just gets real hectic. Here's the kitchen. I'm gonna have to clear this before I start doing any more videos. We gotta start trash service because uh, we're gonna, start collecting trash but we got no place to put it so but you know what I'm not gonna be starting work immediately and there's Ava Grace hi Ava Grace <laughs> this is up the stairs this is up the well, stairs show, show them the stairs but 
they look like. Well, they know what stairs oh, look they're, like. They're furry. <laughs> no, I'm talking about those stairs. We got a TV set that's oh, fit right yeah. over the fireplace. The guy came to hook up the internet. Was that yesterday? Yeah. I can't even keep track anymore. Yep. Ava Grace got a little toy kitchen over here. Yeah. Which we're about to unpack the, the, about the food. The box is my The only food. thing we don't have is a sofa. We well, decide. not in here. Oh yeah, not in here. I got a. But don't worry, we have we have uh, our little armchairs. Yeah, we're gonna make do until then. Our camping chairs. Uh, we'll definitely get a sofa here soon, but. Uh, For meantime, with the sofa. Yeah, we got the slate tables here. We got those bumpers we got to remove. They need to yeah. be cleaned. We got chairs. And then this is our. We decided this is gonna be our. Oh no, they, they, they put stuff wrong all over the place. Mm -hmm. So this is uh this is our room, kind of like I said, disarray. We're exhausted. Yeah. And here's the yard. You forgot to show you in the last the video. Deck. No, no, I showed that in the last yeah, video. Yeah, I'm going to get the TV working. I think I'm going to watch a little TV. We're going to do the laundry to get the sheets nice and good on the beds. And then, uh, yeah, I'm going to call it a relatively early night and then start fresh tomorrow. It's going to be nice to sleep in our own bed in our yeah. new place in Chippewa Falls. Very excited. We'll go um, downstairs here. Ava Grace's room, we just discovered, we kind of put the bed, there's a little bathroom here as you remember. And do you guys remember Dog and Doggy? If you haven't saw the video yet, they were born on December 10th. Okay. So, um, they even have a little room. Yeah, yeah. she's setting part of the closet up for her room they're, for her. They're in the dog house right now. Oh, is that the dog Bobby, house? you're on video. Their collars are off because they need them off before going into the dog house. Oh, okay. Or the bed. There you go. See, I do that. Very nice. Bed too. So she's got a little desk here. We got. We're gonna have to move this around because we just realized that this piece here needs to go over here, and so this piece there has got to go here. So I, know. I think we're gonna push everything against the wall, lay the mattress down. She's gonna sleep on the mattress tonight, and uh, we'll tackle it tomorrow. Here's Kyle's room. Same thing here. We're gonna clear some space. We're gonna push the mattress on the floor. We gotta put his desk. Big mess. It is a big mess. He's putting his little Lego set together, and uh, he's yeah. <laughs> we'll get everything set up. The good news is we got the internet working, the Wi-Fi. How's it coming, Kyle? Long time. Long time. I'm through all the stuff in the box, and I'm missing pieces. Uh oh. Figure that out. All right. Well. And what about down here? Yeah, let's go down here. I'm going to set it up down here. I don't think I'm... I'm too tired to tackle it today. Unloading There's that the, truck. My my muscles hurt. Here's the basement. Here's a little... Uh, you know, this is a little storage room. Monica's going to put some uh, of her uh, yarn there. This is stuff that was just miscellaneous stuff that uh, we didn't necessarily need to unpack. Photo, You know, photos and stuff like that. Guys, oh. this is what the door sounds like when you like. <laughs> in it. <when> you <laughs> okay, thanks. So this is gonna be like our family room here. Let's turn the lights off here. That's a nice sound. I like I'm that. gonna set up uh, a TV on this side here. I got a sofa bed that I'm gonna put over here in this corner. I'm gonna have my computer desk over here in the corner. And this is where you edit videos. And yeah, this it is where. This computer, and then you have another one. Yeah, you're right. And there's a there's a TV yeah, we're gonna have in here. So. Uh, Look yeah. how messy it looks here. It looks extremely it messy. Cow. But I just wanted to show you guys what we're, what we're up against. But we're here. We're blessed to be here. We feel good about it. We finally feel like we moved here. I tell you, the last three or four days, we felt like we were on vacation. Yeah, like we had to go down. home. Kyle's like, well, we got to go do this. We got to do this. I go, hey, we got plenty of time. We're not going anywhere. <laughs> so, so, all right. I might come back here in a little bit. In a day or two, and show you how it looks like when it looks a little bit more civilized. A little more like home. Uh, yeah, a little bit more like home. Until then, we will talk to you guys. Oh, later. and the laundry room. Yeah, I showed them the laundry room. Yeah. All right, guys. See you later. Show Say show bye. Show them the laundry room. No, I already okay. showed it to them. Oh. Bye. 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 Oh. <laughs> right, we're gonna check out the Chippewa candy store. Downtown Chippewa Falls.
the other thing Chippewa Falls is famous for downtown is Olson's ice cream. I think it's been here since 1944. They make all their own ice cream. So even though it's like uh, 32 degrees right now, we're gonna go have us some Olson's ice cream. Let me show you kind of the downtown strip here. They actually have synchronized street lights. Not street lights, stop, stop sign, stop lights. Traffic lights, that's the word I'm looking for. All right, we'll go check this out. The big ice cream cone. Made out of some, looks like garbage cans maybe. <laughs> All right, Ava Grace, you ready for some Olsen's ice cream? Yeah! All right, let's go. All right, they got some uh, ice cream to go. Okay, you too. Do you have napkins? Yes. So, Ava Grace, what flavor are you having? This is grasshopper. It's mint ice cream. Oh, they okay. Call it, they call it grasshopper, like the bug. Yeah, and Mom's having what? Cookies and cream. Cookies and cream. Olsen's and Kyle, what are you having? I'm having the... Uh, the, what's it called? Wow. Was it candy bar or something? Candy bar. Candy bar classic. It has um, I think it has Snickers, um, Reese's, and something else like, and it's like in it. Um, okay. All right. Like the flavor. Good. Nice. Okay. And I'm just going for, I'm kind of boring. I'm just getting the. Uh, you are. Mint. Mint chip. Mint chocolate chip. <laughs> yep. All right. Let's give it a taste. See how we like it. Okay. See mom's face. <laughs> mm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It help it a little bit. Ava, just lick your spoon. Pull it out. There's plenty of stuff on there. Mm. She's gonna spill it, Monica. I don't know what to do. Oh, it's so yeah, hold on, hold on, hold on. Have you ever eaten ice cream? No, this is a little different because it's homemade, like thick ice cream. So, how's yours, by the way? Very good. Yeah. And Ava Grace Very is gonna try your grasshopper. Let's see. Only reason I said two words is because I'm too busy eating it. Good? It's super good, Missy. All right. Olsen says a success. <laughs> yeah, it is. All right, we wanted to take the kids to this Woodman's Market, which is incredible. Uh, and look what happened. We just left Olsen's. There's this weird white stuff coming from the sky. <laughs> he told me we could. So we're gonna make this uh, trip quick because uh, we need to drive home. We gotta get home in the it's safety. A cheap car that they gave us. Yeah, I'm not really used to driving in uh, snow, but I guess I better get used to it. So I'm gonna film inside, let you guys see this. Woodman's Market. This place is absolutely huge. Like this is just for lunch meat. Okay, it starts right here, and look how far it goes down. There's all different kinds of lunch meat. Turkey, ham, pastrami. All the way from the bottom to the top. I mean, I, I don't even see a store like this in Southern California. And of course, bacon. Start here with bacon. It just goes on and on and on. It's crazy. All right, guys. A lot of companies here in Wisconsin with the frozen pizzas. I just want to show you how much frozen pizzas, okay? So we got a cabinet here. All the way, now this is stuff, you know, DiGiorno, Red Baron, these are stuff you can get in California. So we all know that. So we get over here. We got the, some more pizza. This is stuff I've never seen. Gino's East, Chicago, tavern style, Pizza Uno. Some of these brands I've never heard of. I mean, are you kidding me? It seems like every product you could possibly want, they have this kind of uh, setup. So this is pub pizzas. We're not done yet. <laughs> Here's some more pizzas. And on the other side is pizzas. So I don't even know how many pizzas they have here. It's absolutely crazy. They got pizza, pizza, pizza. 
I mean, unbelievable. So why we don't have a store like this in Southern California? It's like a gigantic supermarket on steroids. All right, we were in there for around 20 minutes. <laughs> this, is what we this is what we come back to. Back, back to. It is snowing. It's sticking a little too. Welcome to Wisconsin. Welcome to Wisconsin, our first snowfall. I just hope I can make it home. We got around a 15 mile <laughs> trip. I'm gonna take it easy. All right. Get all that snow off, girl. <laughs> woman. That's okay, I don't mind doing it because you're doing the driveway. Come on, woman. You're doing the oh, yeah, Kyle. Oh, we got to stop at the hardware store and get a shovel. Oh, my gosh. Once we get home, I'm going to take a nap if you can uh, shovel the driveway. <laughs> yeah. All right, guys. Woodman's Market. Highly recommended if you have one. Big place. All right. Okay, we're good. All right. Our okay. first snow of the year. We just got back. It was a little slippery on the road, but just got to take it easy. <laughs> All right, guys, we got back to the house. This is the first time Dixie has seen the snow. <laughs> Dixie, come on. She's having a blast. <laughs> what are you doing, Dix? What are you doing? Oh. <laughs> Monica, I can't see anything. Dixie, come on. <laughs> come on, Dixie, come on. Be careful, Ava Grace. It's a little slippery. Oh my gosh. Come on. Oh, it's go. Go, go, go. <laughs> she loves it. I didn't know how she, what she'd think. Yeah, I, I didn't know how she'd like it. She doesn't seem to be careful one go, one bit. Here. She's she just running it. around. Go she, get him. Go get him. <laughs> I haven't seen her that excited. She's been running around a lot. Now she's checking it out. Oh, she likes it. <laughs> Come on, Dick. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Dick. You have to go potty? <sighs> All right, guys, our neighborhood. What's the date today? The 15th. The 15th. The 15th. 15th of March. Come. Our first snowfall. And it's pretty significant. Maybe uh, so far it's only been snowing maybe an hour, hour and a half. Looks like it's an inch maybe, <laughs> quarter inch, half inch maybe. Dixie, come. Dixie, she's going to the neighbor's house. All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed the, the footage here. We're just going to tell you our final thoughts. Me personally, I'm happy we finally made the move. As you see, we had some crazy weather the day we moved in. It was absolutely beautiful. It's like a summer day. And then a couple days later, <laughs> we got a couple inches of snow. But it's all melted now. Everything's fine. Our dog Dixie loved the snow, as oh, you can yeah. see. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. We weren't and sure. The, and the kids loved it, too. It was yeah. kind of a fun experience. And that's what's part of the Midwest weather. One day, it's beautiful and sunny. And the next day... You know, it drops 50 degrees in temperature and you got snow on it. But on that note, I'm not sure what it is, and I don't know if you've noticed, but there's something about, like, if it was 50 degrees in California versus, like, 50 degrees here, big difference. I'm, like, chilled in California, putting my sweater on, and here, it just, it feels good. Maybe, I'm not maybe, sure because, it maybe it's because the temperatures are, on average, so much colder okay. yeah. that when it gets to 50 degrees or even 45, yeah. you're like, oh, yeah, like it, it, it feels up, like 70. <laughs> even going up to the mountains in California, you go up to Big Bear and it's snowing and it's like the low 30s. We're, we're like bundled up in our jackets and our gloves. Here, you wear a jacket, but I mean, we weren't like chilled the same way we would up at, maybe it's that altitude. I don't know, but it felt really good here. Even when it was snowing, it wasn't like bitter cold. We were more worried about getting home. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so, and I have to say, there's just something about being out here. The people are great. Um, oh, definitely. We've met some great people so far, some local people. Even the trash guy today. <laughs>
We got our trash cans to, uh, uh, delivered today. Where is he from? Arizona? Or? It's from Arizona. He's he lived only... in Colorado for a few years, and then they just came here like six months ago. Yeah, so, you know, and Monica, said, of course, started shit. Yeah, <laughs> well, he even said it's like 20 below, you know, a few months ago when they had that snap. Oh, yeah, well, and it, he, goes, and he said it wasn't even as bad as he anticipated it would be. No, it's like, you know, every everyone we uh, told that we're moving was very supportive and congratulating us and, you know, wishing us the best on our new adventure, our new chapter. But if they had any negative to say, it was always the weather. Oh, you know how cold it gets there. But I'm actually looking forward to seasons. I've uh, We've taken a couple walks or, or hikes. We went to Irvine Park, which is a big local park here with tons of trails, yeah. waterfalls and streams. Uh, a couple days ago and then yesterday uh, we went to uh, what was it uh, the Lake Wissota State Park oh, yeah. right mm -hmm. and that's also another beautiful area and these are all just minutes away by car and I'm looking forward to going on some great hikes with Kyle uh, get some exercise some fresh air uh, but yeah I really like it so far uh, you know, yeah, but, so far. <laughs> we'll give you <laughs> We're coming into spring. <laughs> We're coming into spring, so I think we came at the perfect time. We yeah. just caught the tail end of winter, right? And yeah, we're gonna go right into perfect timing. right into spring. We, uh, we it's met a, a good adjustment period. Yeah, we met a couple of locals who said, Yeah, you know, the winter's kind of long, and then spring comes, everything gets warmer, it gets green, summer's here, and then she says, Before you know it, it's like fast forward fall because. Leaves start to change, it gets a little cold, and then all of a sudden snow comes and you're in winter. <laughs> I kind of am anticipating seasons. Yeah, I'm you know? looking forward to it. So Anyway, just to let all my viewers know, I'm around uh, five, six, or seven videos that I still haven't uh, uploaded from the old place. So it's going to be probably a month and a half, uh, two months, before you actually see new videos of me cooking here, which is good because I want to allow myself enough time uh, to unpack and get uh, you know situated here before I start filming cooking videos and get, and get acquainted with the yeah. town. And, so yeah. we wanted to squeeze this video in between because I just wanted to keep everyone up to date, my family and friends who've already known that I've moved, and I wanted to give them. A Everyone's word. asking. Everyone's Send pictures. asking. Send videos. Send pictures. He's like, we'll I'm just like, make one. Yeah, I'm like, I'm making a video. It'll yeah. be out. So this yeah. video is for all of you guys. Again, I appreciate your support. If you like the video, please hit the like button. I would love it if you haven't already to subscribe to my channel. And uh, yeah, stay tuned for uh, further adventures from uh, the north woods of Wisconsin. <laughs> oh yeah. All right, thanks again for watching, guys. I really appreciate it. We'll see you next time. Cheers. <laughs>